Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today I am going to be filming a little what I eat in a day. So I always start off my mornings with getting water and filling up my hydro flask with ice water. I feel like I drink a lot of these throughout the day and I also go ahead and make my morning coffee. I just use a Keurig. I don't have an espresso or anything like crazy, but I just uh, use a Keurig. I love the uh, donut shop k-cups those are my favorite and i go ahead and brew that i don't mind coffee black but lately i've been doing just like a splash of creamer i love the coffee mate vanilla caramel creamer it's really good so i just do a little bit of that in my coffee nothing crazy and then i go ahead and drink my coffee for a little bit i don't make breakfast right away when i wake up i just typically am not super hungry like right the second when i wake up but then a little bit later when i'm done with my coffee I go ahead and make kind of a, like, a late morning breakfast. So this is the Trader Joe's organic acai bowl. That's what it looks like. It comes frozen and it comes with a little pack of granola and coconut. And you go ahead and microwave it for like 45 seconds. I just set it in there. I didn't start it yet. And then I go ahead and cut up some banana. Um, you could eat it just plain like what it comes with. But I like to zhuzh it up a little bit and add a little bit more. So I go ahead and cut up a full banana just in like coin-like slices. And then I went ahead and started microwaving the acai bowl. I also like to add almond butter and honey. I think that really makes it taste even better. So here I am just adding the Trader Joe's almond butter. I use the no salt one. You could really use whatever you want. Sometimes I use peanut butter too. And then I go ahead and add the granola and coconut little packet it comes with. It really is good granola that it comes with too. And then I go ahead and drizzle some honey on top as well. And that's really all I do when making these. It tastes so good. And it's really like affordable compared to going out and getting an acai bowl from like a juice place. So I just went ahead and ate that. I ate that while I was doing just a quiz before one of my classes. And it's a really great just like um, breakfast or lunch even. Sometimes I have it later in the day and it's really good. And then for my actual lunch, I went ahead, this is also from Trader Joe's, the mushroom and black truffle flatbread. I went ahead and made that. Um, you preheat this to 425 and just cook it for like eight and a half minutes. Uh, it also comes frozen, so I was just taking it out of the plastic here and throwing it on like a cookie sheet to put in the oven. And this is really tasty. It's definitely one of my, if not my favorite, flatbread that Trader Joe's has. But they have a lot of uh, really good pizza options. And this is what it looks like before going in. And in the meantime, when I was waiting for the oven to preheat and that baking, I had some everything but the bagel chips and this caramelized onion dip. This is such a good combo. I cannot recommend it enough. It is so good. Definitely recommend. And here is the pizza after it comes out of the oven. Looks delicious. And I ate the pizza while I was on a Zoom lecture for class. I had my microphone muted so no one could hear me chew. <laughs> and then in the afternoon, I kind of just needed another cup of coffee for a little pick-me-up. I could sometimes hit that two, three o'clock slump in the afternoon. So I just made another cup of coffee and I did just the same thing I did in the morning, threw a splash of creamer in there. Sometimes you just need a second cup of coffee to get you through the afternoon. For dinner, my family and I had leftovers from the Super Bowl. This was taken on a Monday, and this was our Super Bowl leftovers. We had mac and cheese, barbecued chicken, and this chopped Southwest salad kit. It was all super good. And then for dessert, I had these Chromatica Oreos. They're honestly not that good, you guys. I don't know if I'd recommend, but they're cute. <laughs> and during the Bachelorette, I had a glass of wine. I love drinking a glass of wine when watching TV at night. Not every night, but occasionally it's nice to unwind. And not that this counts as food, but I did take these Ollie gummies. Um, I love these Ollie sleep gummies. They really do help me stay asleep and go to sleep faster. They're like melatonin gummies and they honestly taste pretty good too. All right, as you guys can see, I am in my sheet of pajamas again. 
class is on, about to head to bed. I just finished watching The Bachelor. I just filled up my hydro flask for the fourth time today. And I always like to fill this up before I go to bed and drink a lot of water before I go to bed. And I always like wake up really thirsty in the morning. So I like keeping this nearby. And I try to drink like three to five of these a day. I feel like I'm pretty good about drinking water. Uh, but that's really all for my all I eat in a day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like and subscribe if you have not already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!